My name is Jamie King. Uh, I started as a dancer, moved my way uh, dancing with Michael Jackson, Prince, uh, Madonna. Uh, worked my way into choreography. Always had a passion for, you know, controlling everything, if you will. <laughs> I'm Melanie B from the Spice Girls. Um, I've been a performer with the Spice Girls now for nearly 10 years. And I thought it would be quite kind of nice and quirky for me to come along and see what Jamie's up to. He's doing our tour, which is our last tour together as a five piece. Um, and I wanted to see what's going on in his world. So it's cool the evolution, you know, going from dancer, mover, um, you know, being told what to do to actually really influencing the influencers. Jamie King is an amazing guy. His catalogue of work is just phenomenal. And right now we're working with him, Spice Girls, and what he's doing for us is better than anything he's ever done before. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I want to see stars, I want to see people, or dancers rather, with great, great charisma, great attitudes, confidence. Well, Jamie got to see the whole package, all our clothing sketches, and obviously he was the one that was setting the vibe for every single song, the staging, what was going to be up on the big screens. So yeah, he pulled everything together. You know, he was the one saying either your shoes are too high or your hair's too big, which can never be the case because you can never have them too high and you can never have your hair too big. But yeah, he, he looks at the overall look. I need to know that if there's 30,000 people in that venue, that you as a performer can reach that person way up in the, what we call, nosebleed section. Oh, yeah, and I think Jamie's really good at picking out who can do what and how. I chose the, the song Spice Up Your Life from the Spice Girls. Um, I had just directed the Spice Girls tour and I thought it would be exciting to you know, bring in the person who should judge that, Mel B. My expectations tonight from Jamie King in the Step It Up and Dance is that he's gonna show us raw talent. Janelle, still, you know, I, I like this girl. She's got that fire and like I said, she reminds me of Mel B, you know, and Mel B's a star. You know what I mean? You don't miss Mel B when she's on stage. Even though she's in a group, you still see her. She stands out. I like a male dancer to dance like a man. Do you understand what I mean? With manliness and a, pres a presence and precision. Cody, I, there, there's something really cool about him. And, you know, he really stood out for me tonight. And I'm, I'm curious to see uh, how he's going to progress. But I believe he's going to stay till the end. I like it. You can tell a good dancer when you can't keep your eyes off them. Like when you become like, how did they do that? And, and, it, and, it, and it, it flows and it's smooth. Yeah, there was definitely dancers, definitely dancers tonight who, who, who didn't connect, who didn't, who, didn't, who didn't give us what we needed and what we needed to see. Adriana, you know, she didn't make the cut. It's unfortunate. Lovely girl. When you work with professional dancers, what you want is to be able to vibe with them. You want them to be able to do clean lines. And also you want them to have a bit of their own style. Right now, uh, are these dancers groomed enough to, to jump on stage and work for me and some of my artists? Not yet. I don't think so. But this is the beginning. 